Hey, Mark here from Cyclepath in Portland, Oregon. Today we're going to take a look at a couple of mini pumps from Silka, the Tadeco and the relatively new Gravelero. Silka says the Gravelero will move 35% more air than the Tadeco, and today we're going to find out. We've got a 42C tire from Ultra Dynamico, and we're going to inflate from 20 to 35 PSI and see which pump takes the fewest strokes to achieve the desired pressure. Afterwards, I'll talk about some of the other differences between these pumps, and I'll let you know which one I think you should strap to your bike. To get the most accurate results, we'll be using a Quark Tire Whiz attached to this NVG23 and the SRAM Axis app to monitor our pressure. We're going to start with the Tadeco. Both pumps have a removable hose with a locking chuck, which makes pumping really easy. And 79 pumps has us at 35 PSI. Next up is the Gravelero. Again, Silka says this will move 35% more air than the Tadeco, and this is achieved by the larger diameter of the pump body. So 54 pumps with the Gravelero brings us to the 35 PSI, our desired pressure, and it does indeed move more air. In summary, the Tadeco took 79 pumps to take a 42C tire from 20 to 35 PSI, where the Gravelero got it done in 54 pumps. The Tadeco weighs 165 grams versus the Gravelero at 143 grams. Other features to note would be the knurled finish of the Tadeco versus the smooth finish of the Gravelero. Silka claims that this was to ease cleanup after a muddy ride. My experience has been the Tadeco cleans up really easy with just a dish brush and some dish soap. The other feature that they altered would be the dust cover on the pump head. They lowered the profile on the Gravelero, which I'm concerned may be a little bit too low profile. I prefer the more secure fitting of the Tadeco. That being said, if I was buying a new pump today, I'd probably get the Gravelero. If you've already got a Tadeco, I don't know if it's worth the upgrade. If you're interested in purchasing either of these pumps, we've got a link and a discount code in the description below. We're a pretty new channel, and we would love if you could like and subscribe. And if you've got any ideas for our next video, comment below, and we'll see you there.